ဒီတော့ဒီနေ့ရောက်နေနေရာလေးရတော့နော်ဝေးတန်မတ်ကြီးရဲ့နေဖြစ်ပါတယ်ရှင်အဲဒီနေ့မှာတော့နော်ဝ
and that's the, a national dress. Your family come from an area mm -hmm. and then you wear that, that costume from that area. Oh. Mm. Is it so the color? Is it the color it's or different. Or it's the, the color. It's the it's the silver that you use. Mm -hmm. It's and it's very kind of strict rules yes. how it should look like. Yes. So when we have our national day on the 17th of May, mm -hmm. a lot of people are dressed in this national costume, and it's so beautiful. Yes. And you can see the variety, and then you can also spot on and see where, which part of the country that sure. people come yeah. from. Yeah. And this is used not only by, by women, it's more common for women, mm -hmm. but it's also used by men. Mm -hmm. So it's very, very nice. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. okay. So today, what kind of dish are we be cooking, actually? Oh, I can't I, we very much would like to introduce you to some of the traditional food that we have. So we have some uh, traditional sausages and, and salted meat yes. that is dried. Yes. And then we have uh, uh, cheese yes. that is brought from Norway. Norway. Oh. My husband is Swedish. Yes. So yes. both in Norway and Sweden, we have a lot of similar tradition. Oh, wow. And also herring is one of these mm. very kind of the similar traditions similar that we have. Yeah. yeah. And then for cooking, yes. I mean, you, you we always, so many times during the week, yes. we have salmon for dinner. So we would also like very much to cook salmon today. Yes, yeah. We have chosen a very traditional uh, Norwegian dessert dish that was also that goes long, long uh, way back in, in history. So we have uh, and we have tried to make it a bit more fusion and to use some Asian ingredients as well. So, mm. um, shall we head up to, yes. the, to the cooking? Let's yeah. do that. Yeah. Okay, yes. nice. <laughs> So these are, these are very much show the nature and the landscape that we have in Norway. Oh, okay. It's a lot of mountains, but it's also a lot of forests and pine trees. So it really kind of captures some of the colors yeah. that you find in the Norwegian nat nature, yeah. brown and, and these kind of things. So very much, very much like to look at it and kind of reminds us yeah. of Norway. And, and mm. I, when I was traveling up in Northern Charles State, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Northern of so Tibo, yeah. up in the mountains there, yeah. is, is, I started to smell different things, yeah. mm. and it was much pine trees up there. Yeah. Mm. It yeah. felt like home. Oh, yeah. wow. All the scenery was almost like that. Yeah. And yeah. also you could see that kind of scenery in uh, in Pure Levin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we use a lot of you use a lot of a pine for materials yeah. when we build houses and so on. In Myanmar, you use bamboo for a lot of things, yeah, and we have pine. Oh, mm. Yeah. Mm. So let's go outside. Are we going so to we can. Outside? We are going to cook outside. Wow. Please. Okay, so could you explain to um, the audience that what are we cooking today? We will cook something with a very traditional ingredients, and that's Norwegian salmon. Yes. But we would like to make it more modern, and that is what, how we cook it now in Norway. No, yes. In each of Mahalia, you usually start on Norway salmon, and salmon on my door, you got more do sal, or not your dad, that means you what Ali never name. I'm your Alu, Alu, or I'm your name, 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 I'm Okay, so shall we start? So, um, so you do the salsa, so you have to this. Uh, would you have an honor of putting it? Yes, please. Now I'll do it. Surely. So. Uh, 
ตัวนี้ก็ได้ตัวนี้ก็ได้ตัวนี้ก็ได้ตัวนี้ก็ได้ตัวนี้ก็ได้ตัวนี้ก็ได้ตัวนี้ก็ได้ตัวนี้ก